Okay, I wanted to uh, share my drag chain installation on my laser unit. Okay, on the y-axis, <clears throat> I have the laser mounted to a tabletop, so which is eventually going to get a cover over the top of it. So at, at the very end of the y-axis, I have one screw mounted um, for the drag chain right to the surface of the table. And here's wires coming up through, obviously. And then it loops around and goes to the y trolley, so which it's I had to drill a hole through the trolley here to get this small bolt in um, and I put some spacers or washers uh, just to keep the chain uh, to ride parallel with where it's mounted on the table now on the top of the drag chain I removed the stock bracket which is this guy here um, so it can get a lot more movement in this area here because if you try to use the stock bracket, it just, you know, that area is just really tight. So it's really hard to use for the installation. <clears throat> the X-axis, I made these mounting brackets here out of three mil Baltic birch. Wrap around with a little side support to keep, keep the, the base uh, stronger. And then across the back of the X-Rail, I have a piece of aluminum angle going to the other side. <clears throat> now I have the same bracket, just in reverse on the other side. And you can see the two bolts were bolts to the X uh, or Y trolley. Um, and then just a couple of screws to hold the um, aluminum angle. So, and the angle's there for more support for the chain, so it just glides nice and smooth across and lays nice and flat. Now again, at the top of the X trolley, <clears throat> I ran washers again in between the mounting plate and the drag chain, just to keep the chain to run parallel with the uh, X axis, axis rail. So, and again, I eliminated the stock mount so it's, it pivots really nice in this area. <clears throat> now I was able to use the stock wiring harness that came with the unit, um, but I did have to uh, rotate the stepper motor 180 degrees so the wires come out the top. Um, this was the only way to have enough length on the stock harness. Um, and I was able to, uh, this guy was a little short for the laser power unit, um, but I was able to make it work and I still have enough adjustment in the laser head for uh, focusing. I still need to cut these guys off here, uh, make them a little shorter um, at all the points. So, and that's it. This is uh, my first YouTube video um, uh, showing the uh, drag chain installation. I do have air assist, so I'll probably make another uh, short video to uh, talk about that a little bit. Thanks for watching.